Folks, as you know by now, we are hosting our first real estate uh, meetup in Vegas on February 17th and 18th. This is a celebration of achieving 50,000 subscribers. This is a opportunity to speak with 11 or 12 contributors to this channel. We're going to have folks talk about side hustles, stocks, of course, real estate. This man right here will be there as well to talk about small business. Bo Eckstein, how you doing, man? Doing well. Thanks for having me again. Yeah, thank you for being there. It's really nice of you uh, to say that you want to come and you want to be a part of the event on February 17th, 18th. I greatly appreciate it. I love the balance that we are bringing this because, again, not everybody wants to buy real estate. Maybe they want to buy small businesses, franchises. You really help the audience know what's going on. What I want to do here is pull up your website, boexteen.biz, that we talk about all the time. I want to show it. I want to show how they can book a call, referencing one rental at a time. But most importantly, I want to talk about an event that you have coming up this week. So why don't you tease the event and then we'll share it with them. Sure. So um, it's it's really like a speed round. It's going to be an hour, hour webinar, virtual webinar, so you can plug in through Zoom. And I have five different franchise concepts, which are semi-passive models. A semi-passive model means typically you're spending 15 to 30 hours a week in the business. You're, you're not the owner operator, you're managing a, a, an executive team. So these are more what we call semi-passive. And so a lot of people that are w 2 right now that are looking to exit out, which is a ton of calls I get, I get these calls every, every day. These models would be pretty good for you because you could work your W-2 job, get this ramped up, and then at some point exit W-2 job and then scale your new franchise business. And these are models that uh, are proven models and I think you'll enjoy it. And I always tell people the same thing, just come and learn. Right. Because everybody, everybody calls me and says, I want to buy an existing business. I'm like, well, what kind of business do you want to buy? And I don't know. Like, well, what's your background? And then I start diving into it. And I said, listen, yeah. keep looking at existing businesses, but look at franchise models. The reason is is because um i think it's more like training wheels right if you buy a franchise you're going to get a little bit more support and that might be beneficial for some of you that don't have experience as an entrepreneur quite yet yeah so let's show what i'm talking about here we're going to share the screen again we always talk about going to boexteen.biz how do you know you found it folks that is what the website looks like boexteen.biz and if you are one rental at a time fan all you gotta do is pick this box right here it says one rental at a time where my mouse is and you will ask for a call with Bo. But I want to talk about here is this franchise event on the 26th. You can go ahead and click that tab. You can come in and learn more about it. This is Eventbrite, right? Yeah, Eventbrite. It's a free event happening 4 p.m. Pacific time on, on the September 26th. Yep. And essentially, we're going to have five different franchise models. You're going to, you're going to get a deep dive for five to 10 minutes on each franchise system. And you're going to just learn about what's available. We're going to have uh, a plumbing company. We're going to have uh, a senior uh, care type of business. We're going to have, um, we're also going to have a non semi passive, more of a business opportunity model that is good for certain types of people. So I want to give people an understanding of what's available. And this is not going to teach you everything, but it's going to give you a, a good idea taste. of some good of taste. the things that are out there. Yeah. Yeah. It'll give you a little flavor. Yeah. Yeah. I think these things are great. I, th I would, I would encourage if you're looking to buy a business, <clears throat> you're attracted by what Cody Sanchez has to say. You are a W2 employee. I think it's giving yourself an hour to look at some semi-passive franchise models seems to me to be the right way, the training wheels way. Uh, and again, there's plenty of people that grow, you know, franchise models into really big business and, and exit their W2. So any closing thoughts on this? <laughs> uh, no, I just appreciate being on the show and, and sharing some of my knowledge and, you know, some of my struggles I've had over the years. And, you know, every day I'm learning something new. I'm always learning from other people. I think I plug into your channel to kind of get economic updates. I think that's very important. I never really studied the economy before, but, you know, it's so important to understand what's going on with just the different factors and interest rates and, and you know, GDP and inflation. And what, what's that, what does that mean? I mean, at the end of the day, I always think that it's it will get better. Uh, even during 2007, when I was getting my, you know what, handed to me, I knew that it's all about uh, perseverance. And sure, you're going to have some uh, 
adverse times owning rental properties i own this one in pennsylvania and it's just it's just a problem and yeah. it's like every week i'm dealing with an issue and uh the the property manager isn't that great so it's like i'm trying to find a new one but these things work themselves out and and just being able to understand that you know there's going to be challenges and then quite often i i, I fix people's problems because they'll come to me for financing and they're saying hey i'm having cash flow problems with my business or um we bought these 26 units in Ohio and we didn't realize that it needed all this work. We're two years in. I, this was a, a, a deal I got yesterday. And, oh, no. and, and it's like, oh my God, they, they, need, they have like $300,000 of, of improvements they need to make. They have 26 rental, it's 26 units, 16 of them are vacant right now. Aye, aye. And now they're, they've got a 4% bank loan, which I don't know how they got a bank loan two years ago. It must've been yeah. better occupied. And, and yeah, now it's the, like, they're just, it's just, they're just losing money every month. So, you know, I see this all day. I see the pain points, whether it's real estate or businesses, um, and just trying to, trying to, you know, figure out solutions. And, um, that's what, if there's yeah. a story, if there's a story, you can usually get financing. Even right now, uh, we have a, a, a multifamily deal that, uh, the bridge loans coming due and, um, we, I was a little bit concerned about being able to find a, a lender and this is a, a multi multi-million dollar deal, but we have a lender that's hopefully going to be issuing some terms soon. So we're able to solve problems. And I think that's the important thing in times like this is, is, you know, how do you pivot and what, what are your options? And I'm like for your event that we're doing uh, in February, I'm excited because I, I want to bring, I have the same conversations with people and it's mostly around like kind of getting an idea of where to start. And it's yeah. really, it's, it's challenging. And I have to, I have to figure out how to take the, the Zuber buy box and convert it to business in general. Yeah. Cause it's, it's just, I haven't figured that part out yet, but I'm working on it. And there so I'm go. excited to, to bring a presentation. Um, and, and I think that's going to be a lot of fun. So I'm excited for February. Yeah. That's awesome, man. Well, thank you very much for all you do. I appreciate it. Boxing.biz, one rental at a time. And also, don't take the fast pitch. I like that. I like that logo. Fast pitch franchise model view uh, on the 26th. Thanks, buddy. Thank you.